Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please do subscribe. If you are returning, thank you for coming back. Anyways, today we are back with an exciting video. I am joined by my fave, my home girl. Your aunt. Your aunt. Okay, I tell people you are my cousin. <laughs> my cousin. Ify Genia, if you don't know if you... <laughs> if you don't know me, what are you doing? I'm joking. I'm joking. Okay. Follow me on Instagram if you don't know me. Uh, yes. She'll put my handle. So, yeah. Anyways, today we are reviewing. Um, no, guys, alcohol makes me so happy. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is the rose. Hi, Bonan Matel. Bonan, this is not a sponsored video. Anyways. Yes. BNG, please sponsor us because we stayed. Okay, we don't stay drinking it because yeah. this is our first time. time. But we, we stay drinking alcohol and. No, we don't do that actually. But like we love it. <laughs> okay, so guys, um, it comes in this very cute, cute packaging which is giving high fashion. It's like a cute little bag, man. Ah, this girl understands. She understands the butcher. She will love fashion and yeah, we just love to drink. So there's a cute message inside the box. I'm gonna read it, read it, read it first. I don't know how to speak English, <laughs> It says, uh, moments of the real luxury happens when you discover the treasure we clean. Ooh, it's giving luxury, child. A luxury in a can. I love the yeah. packaging and the color. Yeah, yeah luxury in a can because, uh, like, uh, this is convenient, bruh. Like, it's convenient. Okay, so, we're having... Nectar rose, mm. it's a sparkling wine child. Wait, uh, what is your volume? Person, 10.5 percent. Yes, it's giving more than above 10. Above 10 is always good. <laughs> when you go in a store, name you must look at about 10 percent. And this is good. I don't think you can have a lot of this, yeah, because 10.5 was 80. So, we are going to it's so cute, guys. I feel like I can drink from this bottle. Yeah. It's so cute. But we're going to review it and we're going to give you like how we feel about it because this is the first time I'm also having it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First time. First time we're having it and we're having it together with you guys because we love you. Yeah, and we like nice things. We deserve <laughs> nice things. <laughs> I feel like that, that was a moment. <laughs> I can't make We deserve yeah. nice things. So. Yeah, girls with nails, man. I always check with girls. The girls with nails, they open their things like this. Just like this. I don't have nails. Um, it's hard. Open. Woo! Cheers. Cheers, baby. Mm. Is it nice? We are putting it in the most impractical glasses on the planet. Guys, I don't know why flutes are so long like this. Like, I'm kind of fishing my drink. Ooh, hey girl, the strawberries look nice. Why, why do people actually do that? Do I put, put strawberries? strawberries. This is just, just for aesthetic. aesthetic. Yeah. <sighs> this is how cute. It's, it's, it's so cute. It's cute. cute. Yo, it's, it smells like alcohol. It smells so strong, eh? Like alcohol. Man, let's cheers. Something isn't I don't technically like in my life I don't really like rose. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's okay. I think it's not that bad. It's very strong though. I'm just giving that strong. I feel like there should have been like some sort of sweetness. Yeah, it's not if, if you don't like if you like really really sweet alcohol, I don't think this is the girl for you. Yeah. But I like I 
Me, not personally. I. Okay, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. Shashi, but also me and Uncle Frank. Because, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, okay, guys, as you can see by the title of the video, um, we're actually going to discuss a few things things that we have learned in our 20s, things we are currently learning, and yeah, this is Just her vibes. Yeah, everything and anything. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, my 20s now, for me, I feel like it's confusing time. Yeah, your are 20s really are confusing. so confusing because. because like you're an adult but you're not quite there you're like you, trying to figure things out and then out. from 25 you start doing like real adulting yeah. thing and you're just like but i'm still a child so, yeah, why am i here so, like why didn't anyone warn me why like why am i doing this yo it, it's really confusing but i also feel like um your 20s are like the time where you define yourself do you know what's even more confusing is the fact that now you are also like you are being introduced to so many new things you wanna enjoy your life to the maximum because your twenties are also the time when yeah, you just, like live your fucking best life but you also have responsibilities now you're sharing this small money there is <laughs> so many things and it's just a lot but it's also great like i think it's also great I think growth is great. And it is great. As uncomfortable as it is, it's so great. Especially like if you're blessed. Like, you know, you have a good support system, you have you have your family supports you, you have good friends, your your job is coming through or like university life, you are like winning. University life. <laughs> yeah, but you need to get out Yeah, but I feel like it's it's also it's nice. You are but young, you have so much energy to do things, man. But yeah, so we're going to talk about a few things, I think friendships, um, relationships, career, career. and just let's start with the serious things, like career, because I feel like that's very important, because <laughs> relationships, yeah. don't even need to have that conversation with you. <laughs> Well, how do you like that of a relationship conversation? Yo, yo, I am so like if I hear like really, if I hear one more thing about be strong, be <laughs> let's just drink. When it comes to that topic, we're just gonna drink because how to do uh, this PNG yeah? mm here. -hmm. In the beginning, it was not gaming. Yeah, <laughs> really. no, it, it, it really wasn't. But now, there are now I'm it's, little. It's, I have defrosted a bit, so yeah. now, now it's nice. I'm gonna start with friendships. Oh, let's start with career. Career, yeah, yeah, because it's more serious. Yeah, you don't even have to speak English. Can you speak what you want? Oh. <laughs> But me I am No, absolutely not. Never want to be here again. Never want to do this again. But I'm great. I don't know. Actually, you want to grow older. Same, same. Thank you so much for this forever. I know that's not. I can't imagine myself in 30. But when you get to 30, you'll just be like, oh, my life is good. That's okay. I have a motto in life, you know, is to enjoy my life. No, man. Like, guys, even if I'm down bad, yeah. I, like the most that's the model of my life to enjoy my life to live my life to the fullest with no fucking regrets yeah. i actually feel like i am really dreaming lived yeah i feel like i wasted my early 20s <laughs> <laughs> to be honest i feel like i wasted my if you are here and you are 21 yeah, like go it's, out it's not that serious go out enjoy your life go do the most like if you have some money mm -hmm. travel if you, you travel guys guys man, i feel like your 20s there's this quote that i like to read mm -hmm. or like that i've read. i don't know somebody i think said it to me on my 21st birthday which are your 20s are your most precious years uh be selfish be what but like yeah. something like that in that line and i totally agree enjoy your life, enjoy your life. don't 
think about what anyone is saying don't be bothered by what anyone is doing because if you start comparing your life if you start doing those things you will not enjoy your life and you will not be as an authentic you <laughs> and you'll not be as authentic yeah yeah just and yeah, the thing about enjoy. life is you can't get time back right? yes yes very very important you can't get the time back and yeah oh she was she it's when it's a dear like one of our friends shout out to epaphras he says ah or life ah or she can go yeah but anyways um career do you feel like you went into like something that you always wanted or do you <laughs> having doubts now or do you feel like you made the right choice to be honest i i've always wanted to do medicine to be very honest but um when i started internship yeah, i was like why am i here what am i like you start to question yourself yeah. but also you are you think about other things and you're like that's not who I am. So I just think it's you just go through it, bruh. But like I I've always wanted to do medicine and I'm I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm and I feel like after internship or poor, like it's great. I don't know. I feel like um for the longest time, like I've always known I wanted to do engineering. But yeah, I don't think I'll do engineering for like a very right. long time. Yeah, like but that's also I, okay. I don't want to be like dependent on it. Like I want to do other things. I I feel like I have passion for other things and so. But right. like in terms of academics, I don't see myself doing anything else other than engineering. Yeah. At least you, it's your path. But yeah, you know yeah. you can do other things. So well. think you, so. As an individual, I don't think you're limited. If you yeah, can do it, just do honestly, it. I don't want to limit also, if you're getting the best. The money, child, because life is so expensive. It is, yeah. guys, yo. And also for me, I feel like I that's also the same for me because I'm in medicine, I love it, but obviously <laughs> obviously I want to feather and branch into yeah. something else that we're not going to discuss. Um but I also have passion for other things and yeah, I'm also keen to do other things and I feel like that's okay. Yeah, because we are just multi talented also like i always thought i wanted to work in the book but then i came to really? like but then i came here and i was just like i don't think i'm happy i don't think i'm going to work anywhere else anywhere else we need to go on the coast mm. okay i think so it's not cheap is it like is it very do you think it's like what like is it necessary to study <laughs> like you know, like for the sake that my big brother was in this video, <laughs> my other like it's very important to study. To study, I think but like really there are also like people out there who don't study. I think it just depends. Yeah, yeah. but also like in the media, not no, studying. Maybe not studying, you will be catch. Yeah, I don't know, but I mean, I'll just be beaten at now. So <laughs> Just for you to come rock up and say you don't want to study. study yeah. you want but like, why don't you just give me that money so I start my business or something? Why can't you just give me the money so I do whatever I want to do? 
But also the thing about business, you know, like yo. First of all, in this climate, this yeah. COVID times, business is already very yeah, it's difficult for us. But it also depends on what type of business. Business you are doing. Yeah. Also, you can you and I can do the same business, but you, you can thrive more. Yeah, and yeah, I can yeah, fail yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But also, that so, shouldn't that shouldn't mean you shouldn't because somebody else is already in the yeah space that you want to get into that you shouldn't consider doing. Yeah, business. sometimes you feel like you don't want to do something because everybody is doing. Just it. do it, bro. But <laughs> you never know. Yeah, I think you know friendships, ne? You know, in my twenties, what I've learned about friendships is that. Some people are seasonal. Yeah. And like some people Honestly. are just small life. Yo! But th- and that's not a bad thing. And mm-hmm. that's not a bad thing. Yeah, that's all I can say. <laughs> okay, all I can say is that friendship dynamics change. Like, you will lose some friends, you'll gain some friends, but there's no bad blood ever. Yeah. Because I just feel like with friendships, what I've learned in my twenties is that there's a season, there's a time for everything. And when the time comes for the other person to leave or for you to leave, yeah. you just you, you just go. like some people just come in your life, fulfill their purpose in the and yeah. yeah. When that's move, okay. like it's fine. And I've actually learned to like live with that. Like yeah. I, don't, I don't think I hold on to people or like I want no. And also one thing I've learned about friendship now is that there are some friends I think there are different friends for certain things you don't have to be present for everything mm. in your friend's life you don't have yeah, yeah. there are things that i would do like with certain, certain people yeah, yeah. Certain people. And, and like i don't expect my other friends friend to catch yeah, yeah. what i like mm. to be like bruh but why did you do that because there are certain things that you feel comfortable doing with certain people and that shouldn't make it that shouldn't make you feel less of a friend mm, yeah if i do that with other people mm-hmm. and not you and that me, I'm picking me not personally for myself because I won't catch if I see my other friends like having a good time. Really? No, I really won't. I really won't because I know my position in those motherfuckers lives, yeah, yeah, totally. and I know it's very solid. So like, it's fine. Oh, you're saying you won't catch? No, I won't. Oh, yeah, no. Sorry, Never that bad. Okay. Me, I'm like, I know. Like, if I call somebody at this time of the night, they'll pick up and like they'll be there for me. But it doesn't mean which if I'm not. Like thriving with them, then I must feel like, oh my yeah. gosh, why are my friends doing this? Yeah, no. And also, I think, yeah, I, I feel like we don't have to like communicate all the time. Yeah, yeah. But I just know that I'm always there for you. Like, yeah. you can come to me anytime. There's COVID. <laughs> <laughs> Most of my friendships are like with people that I've known like my whole life since childhood. Also, yes. So. That's... I don't know. I don't no, think I'm really open to, to making new friends. Mm. I, I, I feel know. like at this point in my life, like, I won't say my age, but like at this point in my life, because we are my age gives me so much stress. But at this point in my life, I feel like the friends that I have are, I mean, I'm okay, man. Yeah. yeah. But then the thing with childhood friends is also that, um, like, you obviously went into different paths or careers or whatever. And like, people are just busy with their lives. And, <sighs> maintaining, I don't think maintaining a friendship should be hard. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. obviously, if it gets hard, then you, know, you must question. But obviously, there are things that you must do, like you know, that there are standard things that must be done. But, then, but yeah. it shouldn't be a thing where you feel like, oh my goodness, why am I doing this? Or, but, but I think the one thing that make it easy for me. Okay, obviously, there are some friendships that there are some people that I'm not friends with anymore. But I won't take it as bad vibes or anything. Yeah. I just feel like okay, this chapter of my life is closed and we move. I actually don't think I've like fallen out with any your like, like friends. That's all nice. We we maybe just like And you know what hurt the most actually a friendship breakup. Ah. I have not experienced it. Like we maybe just grow apart but like <laughs> let me just think <laughs> No, but I think dynamics change, young yeah, change, and like it's okay, bro. Just accept it and move on because there are other amazing people in your life, and you just gotta keep the train moving, man. Yeah. Do you have like one circle of friends, or do you have like? I have friends? different friends for like I think everything, yeah. but also now my friends like we are very 
closely knit. I think I don't. I'm, if I'm going through something, new, my friends, 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 they know. No, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> In the beginning, it's because we're not warm. Yeah, <laughs> when it warms you up, ah, it's like it's nice. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. mm, you look fine. Yeah, you look banging. You are a hot, mom, fucking bitch, and not on period. Yeah, can okay. catch oh. these hands. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm the coolest aunt in my life. Truly, other ants can fight me. <laughs> I don't know that was so much trouble. I don't understand how like COVID came and just like messed up with everyone. everyone. Yeah. yeah. But also the one thing about friendships that I can mention for me personally, if you didn't have them, is that my my male friends I've learned that or what I've come to learn is that my friendships are much more easier with my male friends. Like so, it's easy for me to like unpack with them and like you know they give you like solid yeah. advice and you keep it moving mm -hmm. like in the story like they don't go tell like no, other people, people my shit yeah i feel like i also have like very genuine uh, relationships and um, friendships with males yeah compared to females nothing against and it's females. so easy man, to have a conversation it's with so, a nigga yeah. mm -hmm. and because guys guys don't take things like personally so, yeah. no the one thing about the Mandela men is that they know the they know Kucha like if he is my friend or they know Kucha Maya is my friend yeah. and like it doesn't matter they like they don't it's just easy with the Mandela yeah shout out to yeah but I still have like cool female friends but also another thing that I think I've learned is that. You okay? I think we've spoken about like being there all the time. Yeah, is that you don't have to be there all the time mm -hmm. for every little thing or for every celebration or whatever. It's okay to miss out on some things, and because different people like it's easy for like we've said, it's oh, I don't know if you've said so you said say never mind. <laughs> okay, so one other thing that I've learned about friendships is that you don't always have to be there when your friends are celebrating something because. I think the most important thing is knowing mm -hmm. what your position is in, the, in your friend's life and then also like just making sure you can count on them I think is that's already that's fair yeah. oh, oh oh guys can we talk about like okay I know this this is something that we don't really talk, talk about, about yeah, honestly. but jealousy in friendships yeah. why are you jealous of your friends? Why are you those people, guys? Don't do that, man. It's not nice. You know, like, some, and sometimes jealousy is so subtle. Like, you know, oh, I'm happy, but. Yeah. Why are you saying that? Why is that bad? Like, what? <sighs> <laughs> also, I don't like it when, like, you tell your friend, like, something that happened to you, or, like, an achievement, or just anything that happens in your life. And then instead of like discussing that, they bring in their thing. Their so thing. Don't like, do that. You are waiting for me to like come to you, so you don't don't make things weird. Weird, yeah. Yeah. I think that's also very important. And I think one thing that I've also learned in my twenties when it comes to friendship is that your friends don't need to tell you everything. Thing, yeah. It's no. okay. Like some things can happen without you knowing, and that's totally okay because the person is not ready to tell you, or the person doesn't want to tell you for whatever reason it is okay yeah. don't assume don't like don't do that <laughs> don't do that and like we, and we're all adults and the reason that person didn't tell you is because like they're not yeah, comfortable no, maybe yeah. so don't make it weird also sometimes it's not because i'm not comfortable sometimes i just feel like it's there's no need to share this yeah thing. Like, what if like I just want to deal with it on my own or yeah yeah that's yeah that's yeah. true so yeah and what else your friend guys like friendships ne like for me this year you <laughs> have it's just been but I'm glad I know that I have people that I can count on like friendship is so beautiful it's like the yeah. little family. That you cho that you chose it and like it's just it's nice. I was actually having a conversation with a friend of mine. Shout out Philippus. 
uh we were talking about like jealous in friendships and he he said nokucha like for him he believes nokucha like when someone is slacking okay it's not wrong to slack or like it's, yeah. it's okay as long as you know that you're growing yeah. that's fine mm-hmm. don't let yourself go because trust me your friends also want to see you go and it's easier if all of you are moving in the same yeah. like you know because it then that if you guys are all successful so, then yeah. there's no space for jealousy yeah, or whatever definitely. yeah so it's very important to like check on your friends how are you doing in school how are you like doing your career and just like yeah things you just flow naturally and guys let's just go together yo enjoy lo man let's just learn that about the man please if you if you just like just make this clear because yeah mm-hmm. don't try and sell me something which you're not gonna promote nicely hello the real pandemic the real the real pandemic me ne rita to enjoy i just want to drink like to be honest with you guys i don't even want to talk about it at this point we are tired we um first of all there is the real pandemic covid but also we blame covid for all our relationship problems <laughs> I hate COVID no, so much. I don't think I can blame COVID. <laughs> me, okay, me. One thing about me, when I don't have money, mm. when nothing is going right, I'm just gonna blame COVID. It's <laughs> so easy, it's so easy to just say, oh, it's a pandemic. It's Everyone is going through it. Okay, we're not gonna do that. Yeah. But yeah, but yeah. guys, oh, yo, dating is hard. I don't have energy for another <laughs> talking stage. <laughs> yo, and that's the thing. Like so why I I don't want to know what your favorite color is. Color is yeah. Like let's not do it. We're not going to do it. Like and you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's so of all this topic is exhausted. Like, yes, we and the thing is, Nate, we you know why I just feel like we'll never figure this shit out. Yeah. It's because we've been thinking about it since day one, and we're still here. Why are we still struggling? as a nation as a universe as a continent yeah. as a planet but i also feel like we are really struggling with our generation you what thing about this okay, first of all coffee <laughs> let's just blame coffee for me i'm going to what thing about me i'm going to blame the big one coffee okay but to be honest mm-hmm. relationship you know why really i think relationships are hard mm-hmm. is because We've spoken about this so many times. It's so boring, but communication. Like, tell me how you feel. How can I help you in my capacity? Yeah. Not in my capacity as a therapist. No, because I'm not that. If you have to see a therapist, actually see a, see a therapist. See a professional. Guys, please heal before you get into yes. relationships. Like, you don't bring your baggage here because me now yeah. I'm already caring so much. My yeah, life to deal with your shit. No, yeah. I don't want to do that. We're not going to do that. And also, like, I don't think relationships are supposed to be hard. Oh, um, because one thing about me is that when it gets hard, I'm not trying to stay. I don't want in here. Like, there's nothing you can say or do. Mm-hmm. If I know no which I know ah but sometimes you hit a rough bed. <laughs> Why are we hitting a rough bed? But like I mean it's it's normal but let's talk about it as, as adults. Don't you know don't make me come after you and ask you what's wrong. Don't just yeah, say just it. Like we are. I wrong, but also we're talking about relationships today, but really we mean men. I hate them. <laughs> <laughs> and this is and this is in my personal capacity please don't go say it please but yeah with me i feel like um before i really give up on a relationship i try fight. yeah like i really fight i give my all like i really try but there because are other things, there are other people who are trying to <laughs> yeah but it doesn't help when you're the only one trying. yes and that's the thing so like also before when you get oh, just be honest man if you are tired right, just yeah. tell me don't just be difficult yeah. in you no know? no don't do that because uh, we're gonna get mad and when we all get mad it's not gonna be 
guys i want to say no if you want to be in a relationship make it clear do you want me to be your girlfriend do you want like you know if you just want the you know you're not here for a long time make it clear also because i probably don't also don't sell me dreams don't do that you know what i've noticed ne? like back in the days when we were like a bit younger like guys will literally tell you like they want you to be like their girlfriend but now it's just, but now it's just no, like, it's it's just, it's just baby and into a relationship sometimes you don't even know if it's a relationship like, it's just a situation going on and you're just like you're just confused you don't know when did when did we become a one like make things clear make this make things very clear because in most cases i also don't want <laughs> Okay, guys. Yeah, but we can go on and on about relationships. Yeah. But I think if you found somebody that you really like, kudos to you. Like, you know, like keep that going, man, because love is beautiful at the end of the day. I, yeah, love is beautiful. Let me not say I think because love is really beautiful. And sometimes now what I've come to realize is some people get they don't talk to you because they want to it's because you're being very persuasive yeah yeah so it's not a thing of like oh no it's it's ugh, don't do that don't 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 force people but don't yeah don't it's not cute but yeah man we can talk about this all day mm-hmm. but we don't have all day guys as we have lives we have things to do <laughs> but i'm mean, like open to your vision like if you do a vision at the moment <laughs> For the sake of like you know, I don't want to say the wrong thing so then the people go watch and they think I don't want <laughs> No, not currently in this month of August. <laughs> okay, currently I'm not. I think at this point in my life, like I don't you know. I'm really just here for my friends and I'm just here for a good time. I I, I just wanna shake my ears on the news. <laughs> And drink this B and G. I would mean, like um I would want to get into a relationship, but it's not like one of my so it's, it's not it's not top, top priority. Yeah. Yeah. Like I want to get myself together. I want to be Yeah, that's that's yeah, fair. Like if it happens, it happens. Otherwise, um No, that's okay. And yeah. I think it's okay to realize to know that about yourself and like just to like you know. Yeah, no, I love love. <laughs> Don't they go Korea? Like, and then also like I'm always in a relationship. I'm never really single. Okay, yeah, no me, I am. And like when I'm single, I'm like, and I'm so sorry to the people who like don't know me like that because I feel like obviously this is I know this about myself. But if you catch me at a time when I don't want to be in a relationship, even if you do what, like even if you do the most, like I don't want. I'm not ready like I won't be there for you like that. And I always say this to Nathan, like I'm not trying to do that. I'm not now, sweetie. <laughs> let's not do that. that. Let's not complicate the things cuz no. Yeah. Yeah, nice. We can go on all day but we can't do that. So, okay. This chat will never end. Yes. Yeah. Honestly so much. Oh, more for Shana. Like even now our grandparents yeah. our Bed, like enjoy we are Nisa in every generation. That's my period. Yeah. I think. So we just like if you find somebody good, yeah. Stick with them, right? Because huh? you don't want to be on the side of the table. How oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Back to the BNG. Why we're really here. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. I'll give her six point five. Six point five. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm gonna give it a seven or seven point five. I, uh, it, it, I don't know. At first, it wasn't doing the things, but now it just looks like it's kicking. You know, <laughs> I actually love it. I, I, I really think, enjoyed this. Yeah, I, I nice. also enjoyed it, yeah. but I don't know six point five because I'm not a rosé girl. Mm-hmm. No, I don't like. First of all, yeah, I'm a gym person. And I, I love sweet alcohol, but yeah, I, yes. But I don't like this actually. If you love sweet alcohol, it's a bit, it's semi-sweet. It's yeah, not it's, it's not that sweet. Yeah. sweet. 
If you're enjoying brittle fruit, brittle fruit is sweeter. Mm. So yeah, I'm gonna give her 6.5, but I'm keen to try the other but flavors because yeah. I think I love those yeah. more. And yeah, okay. it's te it's 10.5. One can is 10.5, so you know it does the most. But yeah. <laughs> it does. But like, yo, can can we just talk about banana? banana. Just a little. She's, she's we love her. The queen. Mm -hmm. We love her because she's doing the thing. She's yeah, living her la a love, best love life in New York. And she's just an inspiration to so many people. She I mean, is. That's okay. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> we can fight. We can even have a fight after this. <laughs> yeah, but please do comment below if you want to see Ify again on this channel. And make sure you, you've subscribed. And like And this. also, um, if you guys want to see me on this channel again, please give us an idea. What yeah, what you guys want to see? see. Yeah. Do you want us to drink more alcohol? Because I'm keen. I'm always keen for that. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Anyways, guys. <laughs>